it's Erin again with the um, Academic Success Student Campaign here in the College of Arts and Sciences at CU Boulder. This is the second part of a three-part series about student feedback on what made them successful in the College of Arts and Sciences. Um, as you might recall from the first video, these are the four areas that students said um, helped them the most. Managing their time well, utilizing office hours, and today we're going to focus on the last two, friends and family and social support and self-management. Students said that friends and family were important to helping them become successful as a student. And one student noted, my friends and family were impactful because they provided me with a support system over the course of the semester. Feeling as if others cared about me and were rooting for me was very impactful during the semester. We are interdependent as humans. And so having a support system of friends and families and staff members and faculty is a really important part of the fabric of your academic success plan here at CU Boulder. We really hope that you find a sense of community and, and if you are struggling to find a sense of community, never hesitate to reach out to our academic coaching program by contact, contacting us via email. And also feel free to connect with your academic advisor and any other support staff on campus that you would like to connect with. In addition to friends and family and a social support network, Self-management was the other main theme that came out of these survey results from students. I really like this quote from a student because it really gets at this idea of failing forward. We just need to put things out there and then we can keep editing and really iterating on them to improve them. So this student said, it does not matter if your first ideas, essay drafts, or even quizzes are bad, but be sure to spend a bit of time as often as you can, especially on subjects that give you extra trouble to comprehend. Having something is so much easier to work with than nothing, and coming up with that something at first is the hardest part of the work for me. Doing this first step of creating something, anything, is prone to yield better results the earlier you do it. It gives you that much more time for creative reflection and subsequent expression, which will ultimately result in excellence if practiced enough. I really like the concept here. And just to kind of go back to my comment earlier, it's okay to put something out there that isn't great. Just get something moving forward that will help you then um, continue to learn and grow in your academics here. So thank you for watching today. That's it for the second part. I look forward to touching base again in the third video and I hope you have a wonderful day.